I love Michael Jackson very, very much. He's, he's alone in his league. He's unique as a singer, as a dancer. Every time that he comes out with a new video, it's like the whole world knows about it. It's written everywhere. They do a special announcement on TV to say, at 8 o'clock tonight, we're going to see a preview of the new Michael Jackson's video. So stay tuned, stay with us. And I'm telling you, I'm the first one there. Michael Jackson's level of fame cannot be compared to any of our current faves including Taylor Swift and Beyonce. As a matter of fact Michael can't be compared to anyone else in the music industry, and trust me your faves get it. They are probably flattered to be even mentioned in the same sentence as the king of pop. Stay tuned to find out why no one's fame can compare to Michael Jackson in this day and age. The inspiration for this video came after a popular TikTok news reporter talked about Taylor Swift being at Michael Jackson's level of fame and people lost it. I'm just gonna say it, I think Taylor Swift is Michael Jackson level famous. To no surprise many people respectfully disagreed, including other Swifties that want to keep Taylor out of nonsense drama, this comment stating, I'm a Swiftie and even I know that this isn't true. Another saying. As a huge Taylor Swift fan, no one is going to get on the level of Michael Jackson. Beyonce's fans the beehive that thinks she is the closest we might get to what we had with him also had some things to say one of them stating. If anything it would be Beyonce. Of course Michael Jackson fans the moonwalkers came out to express their thoughts. Here's why this is bull, okay? My father grew up in a remote village in Pakistan, okay? He knew who Michael Jackson was when it, uh, Beat It came out, okay? This was a man raised in a village that had no TV. Yet even he knew who Michael Jackson was. Like there's a, foot, a VHS footage of my dad singing him and his time village going, dire, 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 dire. This is no insult to Taylor Swift when I say that there is no one as famous as Michael Jackson was. There never will be either. They had to shut down a Lakers game because Michael Jackson was there. And so many people were trying to crowd in to see Michael Jackson, not the Lakers, Michael Jackson that they had to stop the game. Can your fave kill a performance while sitting down? No. Can your fave stand on stage for five minutes without moving or say anything, make fans pass out? No. Do your fave have a signature move? No. Can your fave make hits after hits after hits without social media? No. Don't you ever compare Taylor Swift to the king of pop. I really don't have to say anything. That's half of the human population right there. And not to mention what happened at his funeral. On June 25th, 2009, when the news of the death broke at 3.15 p.m., Google, Twitter, and AOL suffered an outage due to a large volume of people searching about MJ's death. 2.5 billion people watched his funeral live. That's not even just in America, that's all around the world. Yeah, I'm sorry to say it, Taylor Swift would not have this effect on the world. This is 13 million people gathered in Mexico. Michael is just going through the motions. No one gives a shit. Nobody cares. Literally nobody cares. They're just happy to be in the same vicinity as Michael Jackson. No hate to T-Swizzle whatsoever. Listen, her 1989 album, fire. Her Taylor Swift versions of her previous albums, fire. Can she do any of those things? Not in your mother's life. Let's put it like this. In the vast realm of popular music, certain artists transcend their contemporaries and etch their names into the annals of history. Among those luminaries, several iconic figures stand out including Michael Jackson, The Beatles, Elvis Presley, Beyonce, Justin Bieber, and Taylor Swift. While each artist has left an indelible mark on the music industry, Today we dive into the enigmatic phenomenon that solidifies Michael Jackson's unrivaled fame. Michael is known as the king of pop until this day and is considered to be one of the most iconic and influential musicians in history. He achieved immense popularity and global recognition during his career which is just very hard to duplicate. Michael Jackson's talent as a musician was unmatched. He had an innovative approach to pop music, incorporating elements of soul, funk, disco, hip-hop, jazz, and rock, 
revolutionizing the industry. From his early days with the Jackson 5 to his solo career, Michael was able to consistently produce chart-topping hits, showcasing his exceptional vocal range and distinctive style. Michael holds a Guinness record for best-selling album of all time, most successful video of all time, most Grammys won in a single year, and this at a time when he was one of the first to open doors for such music to get into these spaces. Jackson's music videos were literally a game-changer. The productions were visually brilliant. It was the choreography, the captivating storytelling. He made music videos an art form that many artists followed. Thriller Billie Jean, Smooth Criminal, are all groundbreaking works that set new standards and became cultural phenomenon. People in places where they didn't have access to much knew about Michael. Some were willing to sell their last four cows to see him life and that's the level of fame and impact we are talking about. Michael Jackson's life performances were legendary. His energy, stage presence, and fascinating dance moves captivated audiences worldwide. From his moonwalk to his signature glove, fans in awe after experiencing him live. The bad and the dangerous tours showed his unique talent and became iconic cultural events. We are talking about Michael just standing there for three minutes straight without moving and people absolutely losing it. We are talking becoming the entertainer with most impersonators in every continent. Until these days you will see young people still being super fans, imitating his moves and even living off being a Michael double. We are also talking about countless of sold out world tours where fans would just be as crazy about him as anywhere else he performed. One of the defining aspects of Michaels's fame was his ability to transcend borders and connect with people from all walks of life. His music resonated with such diverse audiences worldwide that he started to break down cultural barriers and unite fans in their appreciation of his artistry. He toured to a massive extent and performed in countries around the world, solidifying his status as a truly international superstar. We are talking about non-English speakers knowing his songs word by word in their own way. I actually challenge you to ask anyone about Thriller, Billie Jean and Annie are you okay, I wanna rock with you, black or white and these are all different eras of Michael. They will know I can tell you already. I guarantee you the results will differ for your other favorites, and they know it. I think they will even be happy to be mentioned in the same sentence as this legend. I've personally dealt with people who didn't know much about music but they knew about Michael and younger ones sometimes about Justin Bieber which was interesting. That baby song definitely had people on a chokehold for a while. Michael has been a legend since he came on the scene and just got more popular with time until his passing and even after that. He also holds a Guinness record as the highest earning diseased artist since his passing in 2009 until 2020, and that changed after Prince passing which put him in first place that year. Then in 2022 people started listening more to Elvis Presley after his bio movie but Michael has been consistently at least top 3 all those years. Now let's talk about the cultural impact he had which cannot be overstated. Like I mentioned before we have his innovative dance moves like the moonwalk, inspiring countless dancers and artists. His fashion choices. His signature style became instantly recognizable. To this day people look up to his style. Moreover, his philanthropic efforts including charities and humanitarian work contributed to his cultural legacy and his commitment to making a positive impact on society. Of course, the controversies and media attention was absolutely out of hand with Michael. Alongside his fame, Michael Jackson faced many controversies and intense scrutiny from the media. All types of allegations, legal battles and more. All of those controversies further fueled public interest in his life unfortunately sometimes overshadowing his music but it still contributed to the mystique surrounding him and his level of fame. Despite ultimately passing, Michael Jackson's fame continues to thrive. There are countless of popular TikTok trends including his music right now. His music remains timeless, enjoyed by new generations of listeners and he will be remembered as a pop culture icon for many generations to come. In conclusion, Michael Jackson's crazy level of fame as an artist will be difficult to surpass or even come close to and hell some people probably don't even want that. I mean the man couldn't go anywhere without a bunch of people freaking out in the craziest way and this was at a time where social media was not a thing. Whatever you see people doing with artists nowadays can't compare to that in my opinion but let me know your thoughts though. Do you still feel like Michael's fame can be compared to these generations artists or do you agree with me that he will be forever in his own league? Let me know your thoughts and stay tuned for more.
I go so far to say that Taylor Swift is even more famous than Michael Jackson was.